this market right now 2024 real estate market i believe that the interest rate is going down however What is going on family? This is RJ Bautista, your local Central Florida Realtor with EXP Realty. Today, in this video, I will talk about a smart move to buy a new construction house here in Central Florida or in Florida or in the whole United States, this 2024 real estate market. Before I answer that video or before I start this video, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe if you haven't done so. And the most important thing, share this video to all your family and friends and like it as well. So sharing is caring. So without further ado, let's jump into this video. Number one we're gonna talk about is like, is it smart move to buy a new construction house compared to resale house coming 2024 real estate market? Number one, what you need to consider is if you are financially ready. So what do you mean like financially ready? So you need to get your financing stuff first before thinking buying a property. So what do you mean by that? You need to get pre-qualified first with a lender. And also once you get pre-qualified, you need to ask your lender how how much you can afford all right so once you find out like your finance app or how much you can afford then you can start looking and by doing that then you can decide either if new construction house is suitable for you or a resale house okay i will give you some example or some benefits what you can get for new construction compared to resale house you know i'm specializing a new construction house here in central florida so if you're looking a central central <laughs> if you're looking a new construction house make sure to give me a call text me or inbox me. I can find you a new construction that you'll look for. So a new construction house nowadays in this market right now, we are in November 2023, the interest rate is close to 8%. Okay. However, if you are going to buy a new construction house, most of the lender or most of the builder, the builder who's construct your new construction, their lender or their company, they are giving some incentive. Okay. What do you mean by incentive? Incentive means like they are giving away some of of the closing costs some of the interest rate since i said eight percent interest rate right now in this current 2023 or november 2023 when it comes to december and january 2024 i don't believe that the interest rate will just like significantly down or gonna be like going up more so the good thing about new construction if you are going to buy a new construction and use the lender from the builder what they will do is they will offer you an incentive of a buy down interest rate okay remember that one because what they want is they need to sell this new construction i'll give you one example imagine if you are buying a brand new car compared to used car most of the company out there they are giving from zero percent apr one percent apr or two percent apr however if you are going to the bank and finance the used car from the bank obviously you need pay whatever the interest rate like for example i'm not sure about the interest rate for the car but i believe if the interest rate from real estate go up obviously the interest rate for the car or vehicles just go up as well right so i believe like eight percent interest right now in the housing market or real estate so i will just maybe times that in two probably it's about 80 16 percent interest rate now in the used car that's only for my thinking or guesstimate because i am not a car save i'm not a car insurance or a car representative so i'm just giving you some ballpoint what could happen so if you're going to finance or buy the prop or buy the car from the company who's selling the car like for example for toyota company or chevrolet company or honda company trade to their company they are giving you good amount of incentive compared if you're going to buy a car which is used car okay i hope that makes sense so same thing in real estate if you're going to buy a new construction house or a new brand new house and use their lender compared to the outside lender you know that lender from the new construction house are giving you more for your financing stuff you know they will buy interest rate for you instead of paying let's say eight percent they are probably giving you three percent down or three percent or they will probably pay or buy your interest rate go down from three percent or two percent all right so instead of paying eight percent you are probably getting like 5.99 percent six percent six point five six and a half percent and so on so that you will save a lot of money monthly for your mortgage payment does it make sense if 
it does, make sure to smash that like button. So, that's the thing if you are going or if you are planning to buy a new construction house. Always ask for incentive. And second, the closing cost. The closing cost is very huge if you don't have a much money saved up in your bank account. Why? Because closing cost, you are probably paying from 4% of the price of the property. Let's say the price of the property is $400,000 and you need to get that 4% and by doing that, you need to use my calculator, okay? Because I'm not good in math. I'm just being honest. So let's say 400,000. I don't know if you can see it. That's the 400,000. And then you times that to 0 0.04 equals look, 16,000. That's the one that you need to pay for your closing costs. I just put that 4% because that is only an estimate. I am not a lender or I'm not a loan processor. I'm a real estate agent. But for the most deal that I did in the past, that is mostly what we are getting from the closing costs. So imagine if the builder are giving you an incentive for 4% closing costs, what would you do? You know, or what would you feel? You will feel great because like you can save up to 16%, I mean not 16%, 16,000 in closing costs or 4% price for the closing costs. At the same time, you will have like a low down payment from 8%, maybe you will get to 6%. How much money you can save on those deals, right? So for me, a new construction deal is going good or going going strong right now due to the market or what's happening right now because you're going to buy a 400,000 property with 8% interest rate I think you will probably paying 500 more instead of like compare or compare to 6% interest rate that you will save 300 to 400 monthly payment on your mortgage right w which one would you choose the 8% or the 6% I would choose the 6% which I can pay less than more right so that's the thing that if you are going to buy a new construction compared to resale house in financing side let's go about the futures of new construction compared to resale house so if you're going to buy a new construction house you will get a energy efficient so what do you mean by energy efficient all the stuff or all the material that they're gonna use to build your new construction everything are brand new from the light or for the energy or the or for the electric panel everything that they're gonna put in your property are gonna be brand new so it means like your energy efficient monthly will be lesser compared to the one that you are going to buy a resale house or use house for let's say the use house has been there for 10 years compared to the brand new new construction house the material or the electric panel compared to use house which has been built 10 years ago is more efficient because they are brand new you know electric panel or brand new material that has just been installed there does it make sense so your energy or your electric bill monthly will be much cheaper or lesser compared to the used house why it's because of you know the material is all new it's not been used so they you will consume less energy compared to old or used house i hope that makes sense so that's the second one that i want to share with you for buying a new construction house compared to used house or resale house okay and last one the bonus one this market right now 2024 real estate market i believe that the interest rate is going down however if your interest rate still high what you can do in the future is you can always refinance it okay what i learned about like buying a property at this current market you can always negotiate okay so what will happen let's say oh i'll just wait to the interest rate go down for maybe seven six percent so what will happen is every one percent drops the interest rate there's always at least 100 people or maybe 200 people who wants to buy a property it's because everybody is waiting for it and then once it's come you know Know, everybody is jumping on it instead of getting your closing cost paid for 16,000 you can save that that's gonna not gonna happen instead of buying down the interest rate you know you're not gonna get that because you know the interest rate is go down so you're gonna pay like whatever the interest rate is all right and then then you will have a chance of bidding one property to next property so for example for 400,000 and then the interest rate go down a lot of people wants to buy the property it means like more demand what will happen is people will put some offer put some offer offer and what the builder or what the seller will get is the highest or best offer which is probably more than 400,000 or end up like 420, 15 or 430,000 dollars. So the choice is yours. What do you think about this video? What do you think? If you're gonna buy a new construction this 2024 real estate market or you're still gonna wait until the interest rate go down or 
instead buying a resale or used house let me know in the comments down below and this is the video for today thank you so much for watching this video until this end if you watch this video until this end comment down below 2024 real estate so i could see how many people who's interested buying a property this coming 2024 or maybe when you're watching this video at least 2024 it's already 2024 welcome to 2024 welcome to 2024 until next time i'll see you on my next video i'm out for today peace What is going on, family? This is RJ Bautista, your local incredible real total. <laughs>